Hey Jazzy Greens, how's everybody doing today? This is Sunday and uh, just got out of church and oh boy, I'm tired. I need some more water. You see this Fiji water I'm drinking? It's pretty good. Um, actually, no, it's not pretty good. Uh, my son Aaron loves this water and I forgot that I don't like the water so what I did was I just refilled it with the sparkling um, sparklets water that we drink so this is how it looks I don't know if you guys have ever seen this water but this bottle I should say Fiji comes in a pack of six I believe but anyway this is a good hot day um, I'm sitting in the car because Aaron went into the mall and um, I think he wants to buy himself some shoes. I just came back from Marshall's. I didn't film in there, sorry. I started to, but I didn't. And I didn't really find what I was looking for at Marshall's. So then I went into um, Walmart, found what I wanted. I didn't find it exactly. So let me just share with you guys a little haul. So I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. It's, um kind of hot here <laughs> and I don't have my air condition on because I want to conserve the gas so you know how that is um, I, I think I mentioned it before that from now on unless I decide to change it whenever I'm giving you guys an open invite whenever I'm you know letting you know of a collab I'm going to post it on my community tab okay uh, very seldom that I will put it in a video and then I may if I'm doing a video and I want to just kind of briefly talk about it I might include it in a video you know with something else but for the most part check my community tab because that's where I post all of my invite uh, videos okay but anyway let's go ahead and get started with this haul I first went to Marshall's everybody knows what Marshall's looks like but there is their bag and I only spent $11. Okay, first thing I picked up, and I wasn't going for this, but I happened to see it and I knew that I needed another one. And this is just a soap dispenser. I'm gonna use this for the kitchen. It's just glass, plain, nothing exciting. And I paid uh, $2.99. That's a good price good price for something like this it's just simple you know and I hope it works and doesn't break because the other one I have uh, got kind of rusted a lot of rust around the edges and it just kind of hard to clean it and it's nasty and the last item that I picked up and I only picked up two I'm only going to show you one is this beautiful white plate and this is by Mikasa Mikasa I think that's how you say it, Mikasa. This one was on sale for $3. It was marked, marked down. So I love that, $3 and it's a beautiful plate. I just picked up two because I have some plates at home that have this little beading around the edges. And I don't know if you guys can see it real good because of the sun. But anyway, uh, this is similar to the ones I have at home that I have four of and I needed two two extras, you know, something that looks like the other ones because I have some old ones from Dollar Tree and they're not all that glamorous to me, so I'm gonna get rid of those. And, I and now on to Walmart. Seems like, for the most part, I can find pretty much everything I want at Walmart. Um, let me just show you right now for, um, Marshalls, I wanted to see if they had some placemats, some really pretty uh, floral placemats. They didn't have any, none, so I went to Walmart and found them. And these are really pretty. This is kind of, yes, yeah, plastic, and I don't really like the plastic uh, look, but you know, what can I say? They are pretty, and uh, I kind of wanted some material but they didn't have any and this is the only ones that they had which are plastic so I just figure well hey 
you can't you know beggars cannot be choosy you know so i just went ahead and picked them up and it's going to work perfectly for what i'm going to be doing pretty soon and you guys will see this in another video really soon so this is just pretty much florals and they were a i think a dollar let me see let me see how much are they i kind of forgot how much they are i don't can't oh here's my receipt ah uh, let's see if i can find it okay they were a dollar 96 each so i have six of them and that's going to look really pretty on my table i can't wait then i picked up a bunch of florals just one bunch pink florals and this is uh really pretty i just needed some extra flowers because i already have pink flowers on my table but i needed some more and these are the i can't pronounce the word but let me just show you the name of it. Hope you guys can see it. I'm not sure because of the lighting. So I was glad to pick that up. Then I needed another set of pot holders. So I got this one in gray. Just something simple. I didn't want anything too elaborate. Um, I have some red ones at home. And... Um, I'm not sure. Let me look at the receipt and see how much these were. They weren't that much. Okay, they were $2.98. So, for two, it's not that bad. And then, I've got something for Mother's Day that I cannot share because my mother will see it. She watches my video, so... I don't want to share that right now. But then I picked up uh, some miscellaneous items, just some hair hair products for me, just one. And um, this is a perm relaxer, so I can take care of my hair when I, whenever I'm not wearing my beautiful wigs like today. Then I picked up two boxes of Colombian coffee because I'm always running out of coffee and I hate that. And this is the 100% Arabian Colombian coffee, the medium, medium dark. So I like that one. I don't like the light brewed coffees. I like the dark, medium dark, not too much dark because if it's too dark, then it's, it's too strong. Then I needed some more baby oil. So I picked up one bottle of baby oil and this one costs, I think, $2.47. So this will last me a while. Because what I like to do, I like to mix this with lotion, some nice, good smelling lotion, rub it in my hands really good and apply it all over my body after I shower. And just kind of makes your body nice and soft while smelling good too. So that's what I use that for and whatever else I need it for. And I picked up a bottle of glycerin. Have you guys ever heard of glycerin? Glycerin is used for many purposes. And what I use it for is I apply it generously into my, my natural hair. And I massage it really well because it's, it helps your hair grow. Believe it or not, uh, my hair has grown maybe about three to four inches ever, you know, since I've been using this. This lady had told me about how she used to apply it in her hair and she would brush, brush, brush. You know how you brush a hundred times, 200 times, and it really, really, really makes your hair grow. I kid you not. So that's what I'm using this for. And this one was, I think, almost $4. I don't know why it's kind of expensive. And it could be because it works really well. I don't know. And the last thing I picked up at Walmart, which is this is what I really love it is a beautiful piece of lace and this was I don't know I'm not sure about the yardage um, the lady told me that it was uh, three dollars and67 cents I think she said it was a fourth 
fourth of a yard. I'm not sure. I'm not into all that. I don't sew. I don't use a machine. So it's a really pretty lace that I had her to cut out because I just needed just a little part of it. Uh, not a whole, um, you know, not a whole piece that covers the entire table, you know, your kitchen table, dining room table. But this is how it looks and it's very beautiful. So it's about this wide, but I can open it up and extend it. So I don't want to do that because then it's hard to fold it back up. But you guys will get a chance to see this again on a video coming up real soon. So I think this is so beautiful and I can't wait to decorate with it. So I'm gonna go ahead and put these things back in the bag. I hope Aaron doesn't take a long time in the store. Now, when I was in the stores, he stayed in the car and he told me, take my time because he's never in a hurry to get back home. But of course I am. You know, I don't like to stay out in the stores too long. You know, I like to just get in and get out and do what I need to do and that's it. Uh, I told him there's nothing out here for me and with all this rona mess going on i mean we don't need to be out that much anyway I try talking to a teenager about that you know he looks at me like i'm crazy like oh mom <laughs> oh mom nothing you know shoot I'm trying to do what's best what's safe you know the less exposure to people i think is best so But I really like these placemats. I only wish they were a different material, you know, instead of plastic, but oh well, that's okay. Plastic is plastic, you know, it'll work. And then now that I've touched all those things, I wanna use my hand sanitizer again. I wanna ask you guys something. Do any of you sterilize and wipe down your car when you get home? I do. And let me show you what I do. First thing I do when I get in the car, like you saw me, well, you didn't see me do earlier, but I hand sanitize my hands, sanitize my hands, and I keep some wipes in a little baggie. We keep it right here in the console. And Whoever uses the car has to wipe down everything. The steering wheel, the control knobs, the music knobs, the, um, the visors, door knobs, side of the door, everything. Of course, Aaron thinks we're crazy, but I don't care. Also my keys, my purse, husband does his wallet our phones here's my key here so I'm gonna just wipe it down because we're not going anywhere after he gets back in his car I'm going home the gear which I'm doing here wiping down the gear everything so that when I get home I don't have to uh, do it again you know just do it one time of course you guys can't see what I'm doing and also the little knobs that go to the air conditioning vents I wipe that down too because we're always touching that so I like doing that extra precaution extra safety the seat belt buckle which I can show you that this part here first start off with that wipe down the whole belt so how many um, parents have their kids back in school any of you have yours back in school Aaron is in school for two days he goes two days for about three and a half four hours and then that's it but also I might as well go ahead and do the items here whenever I buy items we buy um, we always wipe it down that includes groceries we do that too do you guys do that 
Some of you might, some of you may not. We do. So, I mean, this is the new normal. I told my husband, I said, you know, why not? <laughs> why not? It's not going to hurt. I know people think I'm crazy over here talking to myself, but I don't care. Hey, I'm doing a vlog, aren't I? So, you know, vloggers cannot, we cannot care about what people think. Just got to do your thing. <laughs> think getting back to sending your kids to school. Um, I don't really care what people think. You know, everybody's going to think what they want to think. Some people think that. You know, you're putting your kids in danger. You're not um, thinking about their well-being because if they catch COVID, you know, you could, you know, they could bring it home. You know, I don't get into those type of controversial uh, opinions. You know, everybody's entitled to their own opinions. And I'm, I don't like to make judgments as to you're right, you're wrong. Um, yeah, I'm not going to get too deep into that because everybody has their own thoughts on that. But like, I, like I've like i told people, look, my son is 18. He's considered legally grown. And we can't do anything about him going to school, you know, choosing to go. It's his decision. He feels comfortable. And we do too. So we're not even worried about it. He's okay. He's been okay. And he's going to continue to be okay. You know, I just trust God and... You know, as long as he does what he's supposed to do, abide by the rules, you know, what they set out for. You know, I don't even worry about that stuff. I just give it to God and just keep it moving. And if a person doesn't believe in God, then that's your choice. That's your choice. But I do, so I'm going to do what I got to do. Like the saying goes, you do you and I do me. <laughs> You know, as these people are walking by, I had this crazy thought come to me. And I said, maybe I should roll up my windows. <laughs> Turn the air on, which I don't want to do. I had the thought, what if somebody would have spit in this car or cough right at me? That's a thought that shouldn't even come to my mind. But it did. It came to my mind. And I said to myself, they better not. <laughs> they better not. Mm. There's a lot of people in the mall. Um going in and going out but all that i did at those two stores and wasn't a whole lot but i was in there for a very long time over an hour i think maybe an hour and a half combined together with both stores and uh, i'm hungry it's time to eat you know i need some more water this is aaron's bottle and my bottle i have in the bag that i showed you that fiji so I feel kind of dried out and <laughs> inside. I need some more water. Okay, guys, Aaron is back in the car and it's time to go because I told you I need to get some water. But I just want to share a couple of things that he bought from the mall. Hello, everyone. Well, I got this um, really cool belt. Uh, I don't Ooh. like to. That's nice. I don't want to show off, but this is a little belt that I got here from a store. And look at the bling the, on it. No, it's not bling, but it's still glamour. Well, it's like little little diamonds. Oh, okay. Yeah. That's pretty. I mean, it's nice and, for a guy. Uh, here, I'll just take it off. Oh, nice shoes. The shoes. Ooh, look at that. That is nice. It's uh, suede, right? I think so. I'm not sure. I she said the is. name of it by yeah. Stacy Adams. Ooh, Stacy Adams. That's one of my favorite shoes of a, of a man. Okay, but those are some nice shoes and belt. I really like those. But anyway, I'm on my way home. We're on our way home because it's time to get dinner started. But I got to get some water in me. I'm just so, I've been saying this so many times, you guys are probably tired. I'm dried out. So anywho, I thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this uh, little haul from him and I. And I will see you guys next time in my next video guys have a blessed day bye